Hey guys, it's AG Geckos here, and today I'm going to be doing an All My Dolls video. Um, I realized that I haven't made a YouTube video in a really, really long time. Um, I'm really sorry about that. Things have just been really, really busy for the last uh, little while. But I thought I would start off by doing an updated All My Dolls video because. As you can tell, the family is a lot larger than it was um, the last time I did one of these. But also, just a disclaimer, three of these dolls are my sisters and I did decide to include them in this video because you do often see them in my Instagram pictures and uh, videos, so I thought that I would just throw them in here. So yeah, well, let's get started. This is Lily Alice, and she is a My American Girl number 55, and she is my first doll. I purchased her at, ew, I just got dirt all over my hands, okay, that's gross. As I was saying, I purchased her at American Girl Place Seattle uh, with my own money, and yeah, I don't know if I already said this, but she's my lookalike. And I really love her and she stars in a lot of photo shoots and a lot of videos so you probably recognize her by now and she is the oldest of the group uh, and she uh, is pretty obnoxious and crazy and she really loves art so that's Lily this is my second doll Charlie Rose and she is originally a an American Girl historical character, Kit Kitteridge, and uh, my parents bought her for me as a gift at the American Girl Place Seattle in June of 2012, and she is really special to me. She's one of the two dolls that I have that was a gift, and um, yeah, I just really love her and her personality. She's really sporty, energetic. She's the youngest of the group, and she really likes to write and read, and she wants to be a journalist someday, so her personality is actually sort of similar to uh, Kit's personality. Uh, so this doll is actually one of my sister's dolls. She's my sister's first doll, and she was purchased by my parents at the same time as I got Charlie, who bought us each a doll. People are walking by and giving me really strange looks, but I really don't care. Um, so yes, this is Joanne, and she is my American Girl number 23, and I don't really know that much about her, but I'm sure if you ask my sister, who's inside right now, um, she would be able to give you a full bio on her, but um, yeah, she's also my sister's lookalike, so that's Joanne. This is my third doll, Aria, and She's my American Girl number 38. I purchased her with my own money at American Girl Place Seattle in, uh, at the end of the summer of 2012. And I was trying to decide between her and Charlie, and I decided with Charlie, but then I just loved her so much that I had to buy her as well. And uh, she's a really special doll to me. She's really photogenic for one thing, and um, her personality is she's really shy and pretty quiet, but she loves music and she loves to sing and play guitar and she would love to be a singer-songwriter someday. So that's Aria. This is Delilah and she's my fourth doll and the only other doll that I ever received as a present. She was a birthday present from my grandmother and I picked her out at American Girl Place Seattle on uh, the weekend before my birthday uh, and she's a really really special doll to me because she's just so unique and beautiful and I love her face mold and her hair and just overall I love this doll so much she's definitely one of my favorites so her personality is she's really really smart and she's outgoing but not quite as outgoing as Lily and she loves to read and write but um, not so much like creatively like Charlie and she loves science and she wants to be a marine biologist someday so that's Delilah. This is another one of my sister's dolls this is Julie and Julie is my sister's second doll and she was purchased by my mom and dad for my sister Christmas and 
once again. I don't know her that well because she's not really my doll, but um, I do think that Julie is really pretty and I'm really glad that my sister got her because my next doll was Ivy, who is so adorable. I love this doll. Um, I'm so happy I purchased her right before she retired and I think she's just overall one of the most unique dolls that there is. Uh, yeah, I just, I love her so much. I think her face mold is gorgeous and her hair is incredibly soft. So that is Ivy and she is the historical character Ivy. Um, her personality is really adventurous and she loves to be outdoors and she loves to hike and explore, but she's also a bit of a fashionista. She's a little bit of a girly girl. Um, so she does like to do outdoorsy stuff, but definitely with style. <laughs> This is my sister's third and most recent doll, Josefina Montoya. She is um, the historical character from American Girl and she got her for her birthday this year. Uh, I really love Josefina and I really, really want her for a custom that I plan on doing, but my sister got her first. Um, and yeah, that's Josefina once again. I don't really know that much about my sister's dolls, but I love this doll. I think she's really, really pretty. And of course, my most recent doll, Girl of the Year 2015, Grace Thomas. I purchased Grace on the 1st of January this year. Um, I purchased her to meet up with a lot of my friends, AG Webkins, AG Winter Wonderland, um, Dina Ambina, lots of, lots and lots and lots of awesome people there. Uh, so I had a lot of fun picking her out and buying her, and I really love her, and I'm still Sort of working on her personality but I think she really loves to garden and to spend time outdoors like Ivy does and I will give you a more updated bio on her when I can. Um, Alright so I need to go because my sister just ran out here and whispered to me that dinner is ready but I really hope that you enjoyed this video I will hopefully be making a lot more uh, videos in the near future. Um, so if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of my dolls, please comment, rate, subscribe. And yeah, you can follow my Instagram too. I'm ag underscore geckos. So talk to you soon. Bye.